You guessed it, back at it again with more season four Hatchimals. I am obsessed with Hatchimals. <laughs> I can't even help it anymore. So I've got two season four packs. I got these at the Target sale. These were both $4.99. Um, let's go ahead and get them open. Already know how this works in each little package you get a checklist and it comes with a map on the back or part of a map and here's the checklist with all the Hatchimals you can get in season four and then these four packs come with four eggs plus a bonus visible Hatchimal Okay, we had to take a slight intermission because this little chameleon literally tried to disappear. I could not find it for a good few minutes on the floor because I dropped it. So anyway, this visible hatch mole is chameleon, but I'm trying to find what family he belongs to. Why can I? Oh, there he is. He's in the jungle. Could not find him. <laughs> <clears throat> and then, of course, our four eggs. I want to open this one first. This one looks really pretty. This is probably an ocean. And as you guys know, you just rub the heart to warm it up. I cannot get it to do that. So I'm just going to crack it open. Ooh, we have a beluggle. And the beluggle... It basically has wings on its ears. <laughs> I think this one's so funny. I do have that one though. <clears throat> Next up is this really hard to see the speckles pink one. I'm gonna guess garden and I don't get to open very many garden eggs so this is kind of exciting. Ooh, who is this? Is this Beeble? Hmm. Yes, this is the like greenish colored beeble, and this one is a rare because of the pink wings. So cute! Look at his little face. I don't know if he'll be able to sit. He's kind of oh, maybe he's supposed to go like that. <laughs> then we have mm, a yellowish egg, so this could be the savannah or the starlight shores, they are very similar. Whoa, we got a Starlight Shores though. No, we did not. We got a Bloomin' Bluffs. This does not look like, I guess it does. I guess it does. Looks more yellow to me. Holy moly, we got a Bloomin' Bluffs. This is a rare, and this is Boomin' Spidipper. Spidipper, I think is the name. I had to look at it twice. These are so cool. They are... Not really translucent, but they have glitter all up in their plastic. <laughs> it's like a little spider, maybe playing the bongos or something. That is cute. That is the very first Boomin' Bluffs that I've ever got. All right, final egg for this pack. It is yellow. This one is definitely yellow. So Savannah or Starlight Shores. Looks like Savannah. Ooh. It is... We got the chi tree, the pink chi tree. Very cute. And I can't remember if I have this one or the pink one. Or I mean the purple one. <laughs> That's the pink one right there. <laughs> All right, on to the next pack. This one has a yellow tigerette on the front. Super cute. Alright, so like I said, our visible Hatchimal is this adorable yellow tigerette with like really pretty periwinkle colored fur accents. So cute. This one is really see-through, so I bet if you put it on a flashlight it would be super bright. 
And then we have our four eggs. This one, I can't tell if it's red or orange. I'm gonna go with orange. So this should be a desert, and this would be my first desert egg of this video. <laughs> Oh, it is desert. This is sand snake. And sand snake is an ultra rare. Wow, because of the purple wings. They're hard to see because he is purple, but he's got his little tongue sticking out. That is so cute. <laughs> oh, I love the purple sand snake. Oh my gosh. Now we'll do this yellow egg. I'm going to guess Savannah. Wow, that one cracked really easy. It is Savannah. This is the other Z brush we needed. This is the pink Z brush. Wow, look at those wings. Those are some big sparkly wings. So I love Z brushes hair. I say that every time, but it is so cool and it's so like just cool to run your hands on. But anyway, this is the pink Z brush. And then we have these two eggs. I think these are special. Because this one is that weird yellowish green color, blue and bluffs, and this one is a lighter, it's hard to explain the difference in yellows, but this one is just more of a true yellow, and this one is more of like a pastel yellow almost, so we, I, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and open one. <laughs> Can't sit here all day and decide which one I want to open. That was a tough one. Oh my gosh, we have a duplicate of my favorite one. This is the Starlight Swatter. <laughs> I do already have it, but that's okay because I do love this one. Super cute. And then our final egg for this video, like I said, it's got to be the Boomin Bluffs. And I would like to get Boomin Swatter or Boomin Owlicorn, but we will see. Oh, yay! We got the Boomin' Alicorn! This one, okay, I know this is probably supposed to be like a maraca, but to me it looks like an ice cream cone, and I think it's hilarious and cute. And I love the Boomin' Bluffs because they have glitter inside of them. Inside of the, like, plastic or resin, whatever they're made out of. I love that. So I'm so happy we got the Boomin' Alicorn, because I really wanted this one. That one was on my wish list. I do have the app. Um... The Hatchimals app, it is free. If you are underage, ask for your parents' permission, but it's super fun. I love all the games on there. I have my collection on there. And also, speaking of apps, um, this is not sponsored. This is not an ad. I just really like these apps. Snups is an amazing app to show off your collection. I have my Hatchimals unopened collection on there, and I'm working on getting my... Um, like Hatchimal Families by season on there um, and I have like uh, my other toy collections on there too and just other random things but Snups is so fun you just take a picture of your collection and put it on there and you can put descriptions and people can like them it's really fun so anyway guys thank you so much for watching I really hope you enjoyed the video please leave it, uh, leave it <laughs> thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to my channel if you are not already and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.